<laughs> oh. <laughs> No fish yet, Bert! Go get some wood. The snow is deep. Up to my knees. Pocket boy, silky. Tackle this tree. Okay. Oh, yeah, that thing is awesome. Woo! The lines in. <laughs> Which one's a good luck hole, boy? It's really mushy. What? Yeah. What are you fishing for, Shuggy? Splakers. This is splakers? Splakes. Really? Yeah. No way. Yeah. A splake lake? Splake lake. Oh, nice. Splake time. You want to go back in the shirt? We're not going nowhere. I have not seen this setup before. Okay. Interesting. Just so they don't freeze, eh? So the holes don't freeze over. 
So if I got a bike, I can pull it down and snap it. Yeah, cool. The auger, the ion. How come you deflate the tires? What does that do? Like the tires? Just make it more. Okay. Nothing? Note to self, put your pant legs in your boots when you're dealing with lots of slush and high snow. Pants and boots. Want me to put this one down? Late night. No fish yet, Bert. Yeah, Good thing we there. have some eggs. It's called patience, my love. Patience. All that's, set up in the shirt for the night. Daddy waiting for him. Why do you keep doing that, you little bugger? Oh, oh wipe uh. out. I am gonna cheat, folks. I'm using my lighter tonight, not my ferro rod. Ooh. Fire starters. We need to make a tea. We need some branches for Who's rocket that? stone. Stuff? Yeah. <clears throat> See if they work. Need more fiber. You need branches? I got branches. Is that enough? <laughs> That's enough branches for you? It should be enough branches, yeah. Yeah. Love you. Love you too. Just gotta wash the handle because it's plastic on this set. <clears throat> but you can see our little fire starter. Just a makeup makeup pad with Vaseline. It's going strong. Dougie. Why'd you put this on the <laughs> <laughs> Right in the cup holder. In the one, one cup holder. Right behind the radio. Oh, yeah. okay. Right on. Thank you. Right, we have fire. Making my tea. Got honey.
Getting hot already. Survival skills. Tools. Look, it didn't take long, eh? No. This stove is awesome. I think I paid like 25 bucks for it. Yeah, that slush is deep, Bert. I'm glad I have it. Now I'm going. I'm going out this way. Is there a ladder on there? There's a ladder on the front, yeah. <laughs> Fire starters. Hey, that's a cool thing. Yeah, this is my rocket stove. <clears throat> We're boiling. There's a, yeah, there's a flag on that one. So, not even five minutes and we have a rolling boil. So now we're ready for tea time. So I got this when Gidget and I were on our trip in the city. Wild harvest chamomile. Going into my thermal mug that my brother bought for me. <laughs> Eat every go. Tea time. <clears throat> On a serious oh, note, on a serious note, when you have wet feet, yeah, what do we want? We want dry, dry, dry socks. Oh yes, oh, definitely. You're there. Okay, temporary dry socks. We got a heat source warming up the good socks, and the hot hands or hot foot um, pads are work like a charm. Gotta keep those feet oh, dry. Are almost tame, eh? Uh, yeah, I, the dogs don't even. Does that feel better? Oh, I got. They're really good birds. Yeah. Really birds good, good now. Lot of time with them. But they're all fenced in. They won't run away. Yeah. He's got fancy socks yeah. on. They don't try. That's the jump. boss. No. Yeah, I know the ladder broke. I'm gonna get it back. Cold as heck here, and uh, the Sherpa battery went dead. Alex had to go back and uh, go and get the other battery. So always be prepared, folks. Yeah, we caught some fish, but uh, I'm just cooking up some Chef Boyardee mini raviolis right now. We're all getting a little hungry, and it's a cold one. So Chef Boyardee it up.
bird on a tree I'm just sitting here I got time It's clear to see From up here The world seems small We can sit together so beautiful, you and me, we meant to be, in the great outdoors, forever free. Dale comes by, Alex wipes out right there. Dale pulls up our fish. Now go to your fishing spot, see ya! <laughs> Who caught the fish? Dale. And? Species. What kind? Yeah. That's a brookie. Brook trout. Yeah, see the halos? Yeah. Really nice halos. Good job, Dale. Yeah. Good assist. Hold on the hands. That was quite stiff. Oh, I missed you wiping out though. Oh, that's all right. <laughs> Two o'clock, two thirty, two thirty. I guess I better start jigging, eh? Holy slaying them on that rubber thing. Ah, 
got your secret, Alexander. There you go. Okay. After fishing in the Sherp. Getting ready for bed. How was everyone's day? Fantastic. Catch any fish today, Roberto? I didn't fish today. Alex Berry? Couple. Stitch Berry. I think he hooked up a minnow. Yeah, I think he hooked up a minnow. Mr. Sherp, what was your highlight of the day? Bert? Nothing. You didn't have a highlight of the day when Alex wiped out on his butt? And Dale caught the fish? That was good, eh? Whoa, I can't have that on. You're stripping on my screen here. Jacket. It's on my Bert, you know he put his jacket? Yeah, yeah, I know he put his jacket. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't know where his jacket is. <laughs> I'm sorry. I did say that as a, your jacket. I was I didn't fuck? know I had it on, eh, Bert? <laughs> and then he he was putting stuff away out. Sorry. Like, well like yeah, I think my jacket's up there. <laughs> then I realized no, I'm wearing my bloody jacket. <laughs> <laughs> oh so, How do you peel a banana? I just kinda split it and pull it up. You got pudding? I'll show you how I use it. Contractor spoon. Oh, these are good bananas. So we're we're split 50-50 on how we peel our bananas. And you can only get these in Costa Rica, so guess where we are. <laughs> we're in the sherp. <laughs> we're in a sherp. In Costa Rica on the ice, right? Costa Rica. We're in bird sherp. We're up in the mountains. Hashtag Bird Sherp. I wonder if Costa Rica, yeah, they have mountains and jungles, but they don't think they have any, uh, any snow up in the mountains as high as they do. I don't think they do. I don't think so either, but I don't know enough of that. But they, I know Rock has like a huge ice field right now. It's growing. Why is that Rock's ice field growing? Everyone's like the Antarctic and the Arctic is shrinking. And then our, the one on that rock, like it, it's huge. It's growing. I don't understand. I don't know. I don't know the answer to that. I don't think Alex does either. Maybe Bert? It could be fake news. Yeah, it could be fake. I don't need my sunglasses on no more. Bert, you want some nuts? Oh! Okay, Peanuts. Too late. <laughs> too late. You don't need your sunglasses no more? No. Oh no. <laughs> Sorry. Highlight of the day? The big fish in the morning? And? Let's see. You wiping out on your ass when Dale got the fish. Yeah. That's a highlight. It's a good one. Highlight. Too bad you didn't get it on camera. I, I missed it. Yeah. I got the end, but yeah. Yeah. So. Slippery when running on ice. Been a long day. It's cold out there. Yeah. And the slush is not fun. It really isn't. It's scary. It's a workout. It'll help me lose weight. It freaks me out. It'll make it work. Yeah. Do I look silly on there? No. I think it's gonna make me fall asleep actually. It looks so comfortable there. Lucky you. I haven't slept. In, in a week. No, I haven't slept. In a I week. I didn't sleep last night. In a week. Robert was snoring. I slept good. I was like, gonna. I, I was gonna take. Long, no. I was gonna take the earplugs and shove them up your nose. Seriously? Yeah. I was snoring that loud. Yeah. No way. Yeah. Oh, that bad? Yeah. <laughs> You're just saying that. No, you were snoring, you and Bert. You guys no like way. synchronize, right? No like, way. Are you serious? Aim <laughs> it. Aim it somewhere. Yeah, 
earplugs. That's right. Tonight. Multi-purpose, right? Tonight okay. you're gonna hear block, me wrong. You're hearing or block the snoring. Earplugs up nostrils. Yeah. That'll, that'll kill me. Hashtag Bert's Sherp. Adventures. Adventures. Yeah, Burp yeah. Sherp Adventures. There you go. Bert needs a YouTube channel. Yeah, I can Sleep tight, channel. everybody. Ad Adventures <laughs> Bert's Sherp. Sleep tight, everybody. We'll see you tomorrow. Night night. Good night, Bert. <laughs> Sherp. Bert Sherp, yeah. That's cool. Let's get him a sticker, a huge one, a funny one. Bert Sherp. Yeah. Do it! So, one of my subscribers, Teresa, at Reese's oh. Resources, sent me that bag and a whole bunch of other beautiful gifts, and she made those lucky flat man dudes from the paracord. So, I'm gonna give one to our Sherp driver! There you go, Bert! Lucky flat man! What's that? It's a little gift. One of my subscribers had made it for me. It's paracord. So in case you ever need emergency cordage, you have a lucky flat man. So you gotta hang it somewhere. Uh, That's cool. Yeah. The lucky flat man. Sweet. <laughs> <coughs> yeah, she made me three of them. And she makes all kinds of beautiful stuff. Oh, I like the flashlight. Look who snuck in. Yeah. Little sneaker. Snuck right in on you. Bert. Oh. And who do I have? Stitch Berry. Good night. Good night. What's wrong, Rob? It's cold. <laughs> cold in the front. Now is this all down? The down blankets? What are these feather blankets? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah. Well, it's a really dang dang. You and Alex will be nice and snuggly up there in the front. Yeah. Bright and early here. Well, I got some sleep last night. Rob didn't though. <laughs> so I'll spend a day fishing and then head back today. Hopefully we'll get a few more. Six, six yesterday. So that's pretty good. <clears throat> and got tea and coffee happening. And I'm gonna do some, probably some beans and some eggs and hopefully some fish. First thing. It'll be nice. Great 
be in nature. Rejuvenate the soul. Got her eggs from her hens. It fits seven in there. The smaller eggs. We'll save a few for batter for the fish. Get this started up. We're on high. <laughs> Can I give my allowance to get the green lettuce on it? <laughs> no not wish you last night with battery dying in the Sherp. Alex was in the front and fired it up every couple of hours just to rejuvenate the battery. Sherp's so good. The Sherp's so good. Come on, baby, make me so good. <laughs> Sometimes love ain't chirping good. <laughs> chirping good. And both batteries inside too. So just in case. Prepared. I can What what happened? Oh I, I had to snug up the rod to get comfortable last night. So did Stitch. Stitch was sleeping on him. <laughs> then he moved his legs and then Stitch slid right down. <laughs> Little chilly in the front, isn't it, boys? Just by the toes. <laughs> <laughs> Just by the toes. Just for a few minutes, too, eh? Okay, I got the chili oh, open. No, no, I Beans next. Yeah. Beefaroni's gonna no, be easy. No. And our eggs are going pretty good there. Cool. Oh, you're frozen with your eggs. Frozen? I'm cold. Not frozen, but, but yeah, the coolness, well, eh? You know when you and I was warm. Yeah, you top bunk. Rottened out. This is what happens when you let guys pack the bread. Yeah. Ha ha! Let's get these cans opened up.
You made that? <coughs> no, I didn't make it. I bought it. Oh, it's a neat tool. It's got a special name. I just call it the rock and roller. Well, you know what? A rock and roller would fit in your pocket and a can of whatever would fit in your pocket. So you could rock and roll anywhere. Right? Here we go. So we got our beans and our chili. And then our pull tab on our beefaroni. And we are set. There you go, Shuggy Berry. Thank you so much. And some flattened out bread. Oh, thanks. Okay, bird's turn. Oh, we need a utensil for him. Where's, uh, right there? Right there. Okay. Does he? Yeah. There you go. Yeah. I'll take the ladle though. He said you have a spoon up here. You want this or no? Do you have a spoon? Yep, I'll find one. Okay. Alright. Bon appetit. Thank you. Welcome. They're going to try the other side of the lake. See what happens. So no slush today, so he inflated the tires. In the slush, he, de he deflates the tires. It acts like a giant snowshoe in the slush. Really deep. Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna make I'm making tea. Thank you, plant. I'm gonna take some eucnea and some cedar. This is red pine.
boiling really well now. Okay, let it steep for five minutes. No luck today. No luck over there. I think we're pulling in. It's been a good two days. Make sure our Yetis are filled before we go. Packing up the gear. And we're gonna be saving the fish. We're gonna split up the fish and then Alex and I are gonna save ours for when we do our smoking. So that will be soon. Hot water. Good. Oh, there you go. Bert's line. Holy, we pulled the lines too soon. Oh, nice. I didn't even get it out of the hole. It was big. I don't know. And then we got one on your line. Bird's fish. Yay! Bird's got out. I gotta get out of the wind. Yeah, good. Good. Which line did you get it on? There. Shallow line. Yeah, shallow line. Okay. okay. The entire is full of craze. craze. They're on craze. Yeah. So that's why they shallow. like that tube jig. Yeah, that's why they like the tube jig. Come on. We're gonna come in there and warm up for a bit. Get back. Warming up, charge the phone, rolling out. Whew. Oh, go figure. Oh wow! I got a big one. That's beautiful. This is where packing up. You got the biggest one. Oh. Whoa. Nice, eh? Yeah. That's the biggest one. <laughs> it's small. That's a. Yeah, it's not bad. Slippery though, eh? Beautiful. Just the sun's behind you, so it looks like I can't really see. see what... No, no, no. It's just because the sun's behind him instead of behind me. So I can't really see. Awesome. Let me take a photo. Two! Two of them! As we're pulling up. Well, you know, this is the spot. So it's like 4 p.m. Eastern Standard Time and the fish are hitting at the opposite side of the lake. Go figure. As we're pulling up and getting ready to head back home. 
imagine that. It's been a good two days, folks. When we approached with the Sherp, that's when the lines oh, went down. Yeah. The yeah. Sherp brought the bend. Yeah, because of the vibrations. Yeah. Vibrations. Yeah. We're on our way to go get some chaga. Show them how deep the snow is in Look it down. Yeah, I know. Check it out. We should have snowshoes. I'm gonna be soaked. It's a good thing we're going back. Don't drop it. No, I won't. Holy wow. Look at the size of it, eh? Oh, yeah, this is. This I is, am. This is insanely deep. I don't even know if I can reach it. We're getting some okay. chaga here. You gotta spin it the other way. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Wow. Where might be right? Axe. Me go get it. Holy crap! So this was our beautiful chaga harvest. We did split with Bert and Rob. Amazing medicine. Thank you, Creator. And I did sustain a bit of a wound on my hand. There it is. Beautiful. My first time in this bag. Put that in there for me, Vaughn. This is the kit that I bought from Canadian Prepper. don't burn at all. Excuse my fingers, but you've been in the bush for two days. Do it with one hand. Turn it off first. Again. Good to go. Boating around. the sherp, Shiggy. You have a good fishing trip? Yes. Tired though, eh? I'm exhausted. I know you are. It's a good time though. Awesome time. Bring it out of us. I like to do it on small. That'd be nice. Though. I know. I said that too. You said that too? Yeah, I said that to Bert. We're back in civilization, so to speak, and my phone just went crazy when I came off airplane mode. Yeah, we're tired. It was a long, long three days. But good, good stuff, freaking awesome. Thank you so much, Bert, Robert, Roz. Roz had a, a break away from Bert. So yeah, we split up the fish and uh, I'm gonna dry out the chaga and then we'll split up the chaga and then we'll drop them off a care package too. So yeah, thank you everyone for watching our little adventure. I've never gone on an overnight winter fishing trip so this was a first for me. Yeah. And a lot of lessons learned. Know your people, do the stuff, do the stuff with your people, right? I always say that. 
and use your stuff, use your preps, use your, your preparedness items that you have. Because when shit hits the fan, so to speak, you have to know how to use your tools. Absolutely.